in America, for, one, for instance, we have freedoms to do what we want. We can go buy a beer, we can go get a lottery ticket, we can, we can go hiking or fishing if we want. So why is it that we can't buy into a company that's local to our community? This is insane. It's an insane system of law. What single possibility could do the most to revitalize community economies? Some of our past guests have answered that in the very same way. Lift the restrictions that block small businesses from accepting equity investments and small investors from putting their money where they want. The idea that we can't engage in our own community's economy, even though we are clearly stakeholders, it's just, it's wrong. It's just wrong. Because the whole purpose of local investing and crowdfunding and the JOBS Act, from my perspective, is cracking open and ending Wall Street's monopoly on capital. Because it's still controlled by a small group of people who have your money and they get to make the decisions. For the companies that we work with um, down here, especially in Southern Oregon and communities all around Oregon like ours, this is a, a real game changer. We're, we're a group of young pioneering engineers and we're, we're not willing to take uh, no for an answer. Let them, let us use our money in the ways that we want to makes really good sense. To try to spur our own economy it gives us control to do that and, and allows our community to reinvest in itself. You know the old saying, NIMBY, not in my backyard? So we're thinking about this as the IMBY rule, right? It, yes, in my backyard. I have to say I've spent most of my life affiliated with losing causes. So it takes time to get there, but we're on our way. This cause is winning and I, am, I could not be more thrilled. To watch this full episode, click the link in the description below. To watch other Immense Possibilities trailers, click the box on the left. And to help more Immense Possibilities happen, click the box on the right. Do what you can do.